Ooh, look who's first. Second place is the first loser. <laughs> you can hear me coughing. <laughs> Nintendo Gamer, thanks for getting first. Bubble, thanks for getting second. Um, man, cough, cough. <laughs> My throat's all like. Bleh, 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 bleh. Um, <laughs> I don't even. I don't have my light on. I just have like this light, and I'm kind of digging the vibes. It's like calm. Nice hair, madam. Thank you. I just. I woke up and I brushed it, <laughs> and then I drove around this morning with the windows down. <laughs> Good morning, how a gamer. How are you? Oh, did you finish Stray? Oh my gosh, Bentley's the freaking cutest. He like pulled his little donut out from his little, uh, what do you call it? Den, cage, whatever. I like to call it a den. I don't really call it a crate or a cage. It's a little den. Mingles, hello! Hope you and Bentley are doing well. We are. <clears throat> it's been a nice, calm morning so far. I did finish Stray. Honestly, I like it, but didn't love it. <gasps> you didn't- wait, what do you do- what did you not love about it? I mean, I can't really say if I love it or like it because I just watched a playthrough. I think I watched Jacksepti- You know, actually, Stray- Jacksepticeye's playthrough of Stray, I think, was the very first Jacksepticeye video I really watched. Uh, that I remember anyways. I don't know if I watched any like back in the day and just forgot who he was or something <laughs> but um Anyways Huh, he hungry for donut. I'm hungry for donuts, too. You want to see there's a place near me Like sort of near me the next town over Look at that. It's a salted caramel donut and it's so good It's a cake donut <laughs> Uh, and then they got like I got two things of coffee don't judge me I went to two different places for breakfast I got my my breakfast dessert donut and then a <laughs> and then a bagel sandwich don't judge me <laughs> mainly it's ending yeah the ending got me too I was like <gasps> what <laughs> didn't click with B12. He didn't reunite with his cat buddies. How do you know, though? How do you know? The ending was such a, like, a mystery, but not a mystery. I feel like, like, anything could have happened. Look at this. Uh, gosh. Do I, like, oh, yeah, here we go. It's a bagel sandwich. Got egg, uh, it's a everything bagel actually i need to learn to make this one of these streams i'm gonna make fresh bagels and like learn to make garlic aioli and all this stuff but this bagel is an everything bagel egg garlic aioli salt pepper bacon and like the white american cheese or american cheese white Mer yeah it's good anyways night nice donut thank you a local place. Colin, hello! A local place where it makes m maple bacon donuts? Mm. That sounds good. Can never have enough coffee. Agreed. I just wanted to hear a distant meow to know that they were close by, but nothing. <gasps> there wasn't one? It's been a couple years since I watched the playthrough, so I obviously don't remember. Can't stay for long. Wanted to pop in. Hello, Colin. Well, welcome in. Thank you for popping in. Um, So... One, I wanted to like chit chat a little bit and eat my breakfast. <laughs> um, ads coming in a minute. So I said yesterday about playing Wind Waker, but I also have those mugs I started a couple days ago that need to be finished. And thinking about how much time I have before I start work again on Sunday, I'm like, okay, maybe I should have you guys vote whether you want to play more Wind Waker this morning or if I should finish those mugs. Homer, you changed your color. Cat literally gets outside, soaks in the sun, and boom, cut to black. I know, but uh, yeah, like, 
but you never know. Maybe there's a cat meow in the distance after the cut to black. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah, I made it to the Simpsons yellow. Nice, nice. So then you match Homer Simpson, Homer Simpson. Uh, you know, when you first came in, even lately still, I think I call you Homer Sim Simpson sometimes. Uh, the game might want you to give the benefit of the doubt and use your imagination. That's what I'm thinking maybe too. Very nice team. Um, so yeah, I'm going to set up a poll and we'll see what we're doing today. Um, while I eat my breakfast, my kind of late breakfast. Um, mm. Finish pottery. Sorry if you can see inside my mouth. <laughs> There's still food in there. Um, play Wind Waker. Or play something else. <laughs> um, or I'll just do something else. Uh, boat. Okay, we'll do, I don't know, three minutes, five minutes. We'll do five minutes. Oh, I've got, I even did karma points. Oh, well, that's fine. But more importantly, what do you want to do? I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm up for whatever. I think so, like, I think I do, um, I do polls when I don't really have a preference. If I know what I want to do, that's what we're doing. <laughs> but if I'm like, meh, I don't really have, like, a thing I really care to do at the moment like over something else, then I do a poll. I have a seat in the, oh, I do. Thank you. <laughs> I saw that. Thank you. Um, how to stop eating bagels because you got braces. No, I love bagels. How long do you have to keep them in for? I had braces for 10 years. Bumble, that's a long time. That sucks. I'm so sorry. Um, no idea, to be honest. Been about six months so far. Jeez. I think I had braces for like two years. Maybe a little longer, but. Mmm. Bagel. I've made bagels once before. It's a very weird process. Because you have to like boil them and then, like, bake them. Nintendo Gamer! <laughs> Hello! Are you writing down that you have to boil bagels and then bake them? It gives it that, like, shell or whatever, I guess. I don't know. Here they're not easy to make. Mm. I don't remember them being hard. I just remember them being more steps than I thought necessary. But I mean, if that's got how you gotta make them, that's how you gotta make them. We're known for your bagels. Where you're from, Bumble? Do you make your own bagels, or you just get them from places? We gotta share this with me. I want to make fantabulous bagels. What? You also have braces? Homer Simpson has braces too. That's sad. I just get them because I don't have skills in the kitchen. Bumble, no. You can get skills. It takes practice. If you want, obviously, you don't have to. <laughs> Am I about to get them off soon? That's awesome. How long did you have your braces for? Yeah, I'm not. I mean, I'm assuming it's because ba bagels are probably like the chewier bread. So they get stuck in your braces and probably can like ruin the, the wires. Or the brackets. Oh, 
Oh, we have a poll going. Has anybody been voting? Yay, okay, pl play Wind Waker, it looks like. I forgot I set up the poll. <laughs> That's so bad. Designer Skyline, hello. Um, maybe don't remember having to avoid- Yeah, I don't really remember having to avoid bagels either. I just remember apples and gum. Second time about a year this time? Oh man. Can me a SpongeBob's mom a cookie or a sponge? I have to look at her. A sponge. Definitely a sponge. She's like the like rustic sponge. You know? <laughs> um get stuck in the wires too much. Same with popcorn. Yeah, I forgot about popcorn too. I got a giggle list from Ortho about what I can't eat. No. I didn't know that's cool. She's a sponge. What's a cookie doing underwater? <laughs> you never know. What's a squirrel doing underwater? Bone the ball, everyone. Thank you, Homer. Yeah, they gave me a whole magnet list of to put on the fridge. Oh, dang. They're doing that nowadays. Okay, it's looking like we're doing Wind Waker. Which is cool, because then I don't have to, like, set anything up. I can just... Pull it up. Mm. Most of the things you have to avoid are hard candy, but don't like hard candy, so it's not hard. Well, that's good. Back in my day, we didn't have magnet lists. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. So pretty! The Wind Waker! Um, okay. Uh, I used to hate the art style when it came up. Yeah, <laughs> same! That's why I didn't play it, because I didn't like the art style. <laughs> I think I had opportunity to play it, but I was like, eh. and but now I'm like, man, it's pretty cool. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> it's so funny. Let's go. It's a window biker time. Pool lady. <clears throat> Okay, so we have to go find a pig. Pig, 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 pig. What's the story with Pool Lady? I keep seeing it in your Discord. So in Twilight Princess, wait, have you played Twilight Princess? I can't remember. Bucky's. Yeah, pig, 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 pig. Yeah, pick, 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 pick. Haven't played any of the old ones. Oh, okay. So, um, in Twilight Princess, there is an area where it's like just 50 floors or 50 levels of enemies. And every 10 levels, there's uh, the great fairy. And she's just in this little like puddle or whatever. But like Dixie was like, we have to take the pool lady out of the the dungeon like the uh, the levels of enemies and all this stuff like she was just like we need we need justice for pool lady 
And so, like, ever since then, she's always just like, justice for poor lady. <laughs> and so, when I started this playthrough, I was like, oh, what should we name this link? And then everybody was like, poor lady. <laughs> Justice for pool lady. Okay, you know what I should do though? I need to figure out how to get like a, a little like on the screen here like a Great fairy maybe like I don't know if I can do like randomized and it'll just bring up like a video of one of multiple videos of the great fairies from the different games and then have, you know, and anytime someone says justice for pool lady, one of them comes up. <laughs> Mr. Spill, hello, welcome in. Morning, Kimmy, this game is too adorable. <laughs> How are you today? I'm doing good. This is day two of Wind Waker on our journey of playing all of the Zelda games in lore order. <laughs> And this has been a very highly waited for game. But how are you doing? How is your Friday? I hope it's going well. <clears throat> this be the bomb shop. Go on and use uh, that to look around. Um, eh? Oh, this is number of bombs. I was like, wait a minute, 10,000, 20,000? That's a lot of money. My ancestors been making bombs for generations, uh-huh. Now, seems like I'm the only person left in the world who still works in the bomb industry. Which means I'm the best in the world, and which means I don't go selling my work without approving who I s who of who I sell it to. And I don't approve of you, so beat it. Well, fine. <laughs> um, she actually just said the game is so ugly. <laughs> <laughs> sort of. <laughs> I played it this back in, in the day and enjoyed it, but I took a break from it, then just got where I was at and was I was doing so I ended up never beating it. No <laughs> Yeah, so Bumble and I were both talking about how like back in the day we just like did not like the art style of this game at all, so we didn't play it. Or I didn't you know, I didn't play it. I don't know, Bumble, did you did you end up playing it eventually? Or have you not play <laughs> played it? Oh, oh, if you please, young boy there. Please help me. Please listen to my tale of woe. You know. <laughs> okay. Oh, 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 my sweet, sweet daughter. My only daughter, poor Maggie. She is captured by a bunch of villains and taken to the Forsaken Fortress. What on earth could these scoundrels want with her? Are they just roaming around looking for young maidens? Are they just evil creatures who delight in mischief? Well, crud, having a kidnapped daughter doesn't get you a single rupee, you know. Please, please save my poor daughter. I beg of you. Here I stand begging. I hope you'll give those scoundrels in the Forsaken Forest a good scare. They'll pay for what they've done. Oh, yes, pay. <sighs> well, I'll, I'll rescue her because I gotta rescue my sister. Um... No, I've never played it. In my child brain, it went from hottie link to cartoon baby. <laughs> yes! You understand. You understand. That's so funny. What was it about it? If an old beggar came up to me, I'd be like, sus. <laughs> oh no. Mmm, bagel. Okay, sorry. Good morning! Welcome to the island's postal service. What do you have for delivery? Mm, nothing. We're supposed to find... Dang, this person looks pouty. A sale? We need to find a sale. I should probably talk to all these people and figure out what they do, don't, shouldn't I? Oh, if you could just indulge me for a moment, please admit that I'm looking fine. 
Why, looking this fine, would have won me the Miss Windfall crown way back when. I'm still looking better than all the younger girls I know. <laughs> mm. So you're not a fan of the cell shaded grab? Yeah, not really. I mean, I... Because I watched a show not long ago um, with cell shading, and so I kind of got over it, but like... Yeah, I prefer like Twilight Princess graphics or I mean honestly even Ocarina of Time. <laughs> ah, there's a rupee up there. How do I get up there? Mm, oh, can I I can't grab these. Lift. Throw. Okay, that didn't do anything. Wasn't Tears of the Kingdom Breath of the Wild shall say to is is it? It probably is. I think maybe just the cell shading nowadays is better looking than than this. I don't know. <laughs> Ocarina of Time was great, but was limited by graphics abilities of the system. I mean, true, but I still like it. Mm. Oh. Hello, hello, hello! Are you standing in the one and only Jew Jelly Juice Shop? You must have heard our potions are the best, I'm telling you. They're too good. In fact, they're absolutely incredible. Hmm, what's that? What's Chew Jelly, you ask, looking somewhat bewildered? Oh, sir, you simply must be joking. You don't know what Chew Jelly is. Well, just ask yourself this, good sir. What is the robustly nourishing element? What is a mystical substance that is good for the body and mind? Ask yourself. The words chew jelly roar out in answer to these questions, proclaiming themselves to be true. Why, it, it is the key ingredient in the most effective potions around. All you have to do is bring an empty bottle to my little juice shop here, and I'll let you have a taste. Which begs the question, sir. Do you have an empty bottle? I do not! <laughs> Ocarina of Time is my second favorite Zelda game. A Link to the Past is... So many people love Link to the Past. But Ocarina of Time is real close to it. I think I started A Link to the Past, but I never finished it. On, I think it was like on DS or something. I don't know, maybe it was Switch, the newer version. Um, which version is this? This game? Are there different versions of Wind Waker? Are you asking about the Link to the Pet? Can't wait to play the Zelda games. I saw your schedule, Bumble. I was like, you still got a long way to go then. Oh, shoot. You little weasel! Well, thank you so much for coming into my home and breaking my high-priced vases. If you break any more, I assure you that I shall not let it go lightly. No, sir, not at all. I shall require compensation. Um, Wind Waker OG is on GameCube. Wind Waker HD. Oh, there's two. Link to the Past is so bloody charming. Um, I don't know which one this is. If that helps answer your question in a mysterious way. <laughs> Um, I just want to get my money's worth from Baldur's Gate 3 and Elden Ring. I, I agree, those games are pricey. Good game. Well, I don't- I haven't gotten Baldur's Gate 3, but Elden Ring. Pricey but good. So I'm gonna play that for two months until the new Echoes of Wisdom! I need to figure out where Echoes of Wisdom falls in the timeline. I saw your title screen, it wasn't HD. I saw your title screen, it wasn't HD. Okay, so this is the OG then. Out of ring, I got stuck on a hard part and got discouraged, no! What hard part? You're looking for a sail? I have no idea where you'd find one, but I look like a sailor to you. But do I look like a sailor to you? Look, I'm feeling down right now, so shove off, will ya? Drop anchor somewhere else. Or elsewhere. Gosh, I'm like making up my own words. <laughs> it's all hard. <laughs> More bumble. No. I mean, it is hard. I just... You just gotta keep going. 
Well, what do you think about my outfit? You don't see clothes like this often, do you? Aren't they so cute? A friend of mine who lives on Outlast Island set this up outfit to me. Outset Island. She's an amazing girl. She can put jars on her head and walk around like it's nothing at all. I have to see it to believe it. You have to see it to believe it. Gosh, I'm messing up all the dialogue. Hey, welcome. It's ten rupees per game, kid. You wanna play or what? Uh, no thanks. No, whatever. Come back soon or not. Um, what's we here? Felt, uh, felt that Elden Ring, the base game, was the easiest from software game they made. Elden Ring, the bait, like, without DLC is the easiest software game? Or from software? So many OP builds to use. Talking base game only. What do you mean by base game? You're talking about, like, without... Um, excuse me, what? <laughs> uh, for sure, it's so much easier than a game like Sekiro. I did get Sekiro. I want to play Sekiro. Uh, I know it's optional, but I don't want to skip it. Oh, wait, wait. Oops, I miss. I'm at Redan's castle at the Crucible Knight and Wolf Guy fight. Crucible and what? Crucible? I don't think I've done those. Um... Excuse me, easiest game. <laughs> yeah, base game not including DLC. Okay, okay, got you. Bumble's sad because, or like getting, uh, uh, what is it? Capital letters because her and I both have died like a million times. So she just has to beat things. Sekiro is like the hardest from software. Is it really? I'm excited to play it now. Compared to their other games, it's definitely the easiest they have made hands down. Even from the Souls games? Mm. Hmm. Well, if you played it a shit ton, was your first playthrough really hard then? <laughs> Well, Toad says it's easy because every time I talk to Toad about Elden Ring, he talks about how he just likes running around and like picking flowers. <laughs> I'm sure he's like beat enemies and stuff, but he said it's like his cozy game. <laughs> I'm not saying it's easy just compared to the other games. Got it, got it. Okay, okay. <laughs> yes, he always talks about picking flowers. <laughs> That's like every time I talk to Elden Ring, he's like, I just like picking flowers. <laughs> It cracks me up. You know, this thing may look like a windmill, but it's actually a wind-powered ferris wheel. It used to be harnessed, the wind's power to spin in quite a nifty manner. But we rarely get a favorable wind around here anymore, so it doesn't budge. I'm pretty sure it's not broken or anything, though, so if the wind blew in the right direction again, we just have to hit the power switch out back to get it moving. Hmm, it looks like a... Westerly wind is blowing now. A westerly wind? Say no more. I have no idea. Uh, how do I get it to? Uh, how do I get it to move? Oh wait, I can jump in here. I want to go on the Ferris wheel. We. I don't really know how to. I missed apparently what I need to do. Mm, going somewhere else now, I guess. <laughs> um, I'm a feed for from software games. I have 100% Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls Remastered, Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 3, Sekiro on both PlayStation, Xbox, and Elden Ring on PlayStation and Xbox. Oh my god, that's impressive. Yeah, it teach me some by <laughs> Happy to help with any tips and tricks. Sekiro might just be my favorite game of theirs though. Love the combat system. Feels so good when you master it. I bet. I've heard that it's uh, a good game. Oh no, what's your problem? 
Mm, I wonder. I wonder if a boy like you will do. It's difficult to tell. Yes, difficult. You see, my one and only daughter, Mila, was taken away from me to a frightening place called the Forsaken Fortress. I have asked many to rescue her, but it seems to be a difficult voyage to do that cursed place. Oh, to see my sweet Mila again. My precious little daughter. I worry so over her fair welfare. Farewell. <laughs> I can't recall the last time I slept more than a wink. I sincerely wonder about the wisdom of asking a boy like you to do this. But would you lend a hand and help rescue my precious daughter? Sure thing, dude. You are a brave boy to take on this task, I assure you. If you do rescue her, I will pay you as much money as it takes. I'd give my entire fortune for her safety. Honestly, I just need a rupee bag so I can get some more rupees. That's that's all I need. I think. Where is this sail that we need? Oh, I forgot I'm still playing this music. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute, why is this other music playing <laughs> that does not sound like Zelda music? Um... Did I already come in here? No, I didn't. <clears throat> What's up, dude? Mm, no, I would have to say that I've never seen your face before, have I? Hmm, now, intriguing. Be gulling. I know you're just a small child, but I found one can rarely trust strangers. Where is it that you've come from, young sir? I'm sorry, but the years have made me wary. Once long ago, I rented a room out to a traveler for a single night. The next dawn, my precious Picto box was stolen. Tell me, young sir, why are good deeds so often repaid with cruelty? I spread kindness where I can, and still my box does not come back to me. It is a sad thing. Chrisilla, hello, welcome in, welcome in. How are you doing today? <laughs> you may look like a child, but you can see why I cannot be assured of your youth. Be a good boy and be gone. Shoo shoo. I'm good and you are doing great. I'm doing great. I'm wandering all over the place trying to find where this uh, sail is for this talking boat we got yesterday. Um, what was it again? The uh, lions of something? Something of lions? What are all these little kids doing? This is creepy! Yo, bud! Are you looking for a picto box or something? Yeah, I thought so. There ain't nothing in this town that we killer bees don't know. Mungus! <clears throat> Boss, I heard about this from my dad. A while back, this thief th stole a picto box, and he was and he was held in town jail for a long, long time. Yeah, real long. That thief managed to get free after a while, but the box he stole never got found. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Maybe it's still hidden somewhere in the jail cell, don't you think, maybe? Give me a break. How stupid would that be? Real stupid. That's how stupid. <laughs> Go to school, kids. Yeah, right? Go to school. Oh. Why are you wearing, like, a whole on poncho thing? My story is a strange one. I came across cursed seas from a land far away. A land where the blizzards blow violently, heading from this town called Windfall. He's secretly a vampire. But dear me, as I traveled, a terrible storm descended and tore my ship to bits. Yet mysteriously, only that escaped without as much as a mark on it. From the looks of you, I would say you are a traveler as well. And yes indeed. Could you not purchase that from me? It is my one and only heirloom from home. The people of this town do not seem the least bit interested in that, despite the fact that it would help them travel the dangerous sea about their town. 
This sounds like he's got a, um, a sale for us. Please, I beg of you. I wish to open a business here in this town, so I am in desperate need of finances. How does 80 rupees sound? Yes, yes, yes. Thank you very much indeed. I have received precisely 80 rupees for it. I can use these funds to finance my new business. So oh, dear me, what a happy day. Very well, young master. As I promised, please take that. Yes! The sale! Something is new? Front light? I didn't turn my... I have the front light on. But I didn't turn my, like, room light on. Is that what's new? I've always had this light. But I didn't turn the back light on. The hair? Is it the hair? Oh, maybe because I can see you stream at night. Yeah, well, like, I normally always turn the bed- or the bedroom, is not this is my living room. I always turn the, the light on, like, in the room. But today I was lazy and did it. <laughs> so, even- even when it's daytime. Uh, the hair, maybe. I mean, I had- I had the hair fresh yesterday. What is that? It's a bagel sandwich! It's so good. It's a uh, everything bagel, egg, bacon, garlic aioli, salt, pepper, and American cheese. Mmm. Gonna be gonna get my breaking sauce again. Oh my golly gee, bagel giveaway, please. <laughs> I got it at the local gas station. It's not one I made. But I would like to make it. Because it, if I just make it myself, it'll save me money, I think, right? British? Um, Canadian? <laughs> what you say about me, mom, mate? <laughs> Drugs, good morning. How are you? That's so funny. You're such an adorable, sweet, kind of nice, fantastic one of all. Thank you so much. Chris, you're so sweet. What the heck? That's so sweet. Enjoy your Tim Hortons or poutine. <laughs> I'm just getting oats because I'm boring. Hey, oats is good for you. It keeps you filled. Tim's is so bad. <laughs> what do you not like about Tim's? Mmm. Mmm. Yes, eat breakfast. That's so sweet. Thank you, Chris. Thank you. No, so sweet. Thank you. I'm just like making a mess over here eating. <laughs> what about poutine? I don't like cheese, so I don't eat poutine. You don't like cheese? Dang, Chris, still gonna make me blush, right? That's so nice. I'm glad you're part of our community too, Chris. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. You have made a good purchase today, my young master. Oh, boosted. You should've got here earlier when we started because I did a poll for whether we would keep working on the mugs or play Wind Waker. Wind Waker won. The mugs are still sitting. I did- I did touch them. <gasps> oh my gosh, I just- hold on. Wait, you know that octopus mug I've been working on? Oh man, the lighting.
Yo! Yeah, I mean, there we go. That's kind of better. And then the like, the little tentacle suction cup things. Yeah. Though, I will say, it didn't quite turn out like how I was thinking. I think I, I'm, I'm so bad at reading directions and instructions. I thought I was using an underglaze to paint this. And turns out I was using something called a wonder glaze, which I don't really know what that is. I've never used a wonder glaze before. So I have to, I need to like do a little research because I was supposed to do the bisque fire. It's bisque. But I don't know, oh my gosh, there is a crack. I don't know, it's like, I might have messed this up because of what I used to paint it. But I'm not entirely sure. I think I need to like do another coat and refire it. But I'm, I don't know. Worst case, it's for display. Yeah, but it's for someone. Like, I wanted them to be able to use it. Um, it's not for me. I was making it as a trade because someone gave me some of their uh, fire roasted coffee that they make. And I was like, ooh, if you won't let me pay for it, let me make you a mug. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> that one came out so nice. Thank you. That's really detail work. I missed the assembly of- uh, I didn't stream the assembly of it. I didn't assem- I assembled it off stream and painted it off stream and everything. Bruh, the swirl at the bottom of your coffee. No, the mu- wait, bruh, swirl the bottom of your coffee. Ugh. Swirl. It's just stuck at the bottom. Um, you could put a rubber liner in there so it's like holding keys and change, etc. But it, coffee gift repaid with mug, yeah. Um, but again, it's not for me, so it's like up to them. I'm sure they wanted to use it as like an actual mug. But I don't know. One coffee down. Coffee two times. Okay, this two week Minecraft phase is beating my ass. What do you mean two week Minecraft fail? Now I want coffee. Oh my gosh, she's got another one. <laughs> right. Yeah. And you have saved my life and business as well. Treasure it dearly. It is the finest sale in the world. Treat it as such. I have the sale. I'm a coffee addict. Not, not really, but sometimes. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I don't know if I need anything else. Dun, dun. I mean, there was bombs, but I couldn't get bombs. Here we go. <clears throat> oh! That look in your eye. So you found yourself a sale, have you? Very well. Then I shall teach you the art of sailing. Come next to my hull and press A to climb aboard. Set the sail you got to whatever and press that same button to hoist it. The sail will catch wind which will push the boat forward. And forward that appears behind me indicates wind direction. Oh, the arrow. It's a meme that most friend groups who play games will just have two to three week periods where they play nothing but Minecraft. Or two to three week periods of playing nothing but whatever new game came out. Because I got friends like that. <laughs> um, oh my gosh. My nose is getting... You know, okay. I, I want to know for the people that clean their homes and stuff. I was listening to a podcast... And the podcast had nothing to do with cleaning. Um. Ah! What is this fun fact? 
I'm seeing it, but I don't know if I want to allow it because it's crazy. What? Like Nintendo the game company? Minecraft tends to be the reoccurring game. Oh, for is, I mean, I don't play Minecraft anymore, but I have a group of people in another Discord that it's literally like every new game comes out, they're like obsessed with it for like a week or two, and then this new game comes out, and then they become obsessed with that, and it just like goes on and on and on. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, I can't keep up with you guys and your games. You're buying so many games. <laughs> um, try it when you want to adjust your speed. But angry dejections, hello. Let's, welcome in, welcome in. Dice, je dice injection. Angry dice inject. Oh, I was, I was starting to talk. Okay, so my nose is like, it sounds stuffy. Kimmy, you show cute. What do you mean? <laughs> um... So, going back, so I've, I've been listening to podcasts, and the podcast had nothing to do with cleaning, but she had mentioned something in there about cleaning, and how, like, cleaning with, like, chemicals, bleach, whatever, will actually lower, I guess, your immune system or something, and then you get sick, or, like, you get stuffy nose, whatever, and so you should be using more, like, natural cleaning things instead so that it doesn't ruin your immune system or weaken you. Is that like, what is that? Is that, do you guys know what I'm talking about? I didn't look it up myself, but I was like, I cleaned my whole house except for my bedroom. I still have, I'm in the middle of cleaning that, but I cleaned my kitchen, bathroom, living room, and used like cleaning products. And since then, my nose every has been getting, like, stuffy. And I'm like, what is happening? Or is it just because I've kicked all the dust up in the air now? <laughs> I don't know anything about that, but I'd rather use chemicals to make sure it's clean, right? Um, do you understand all that? Sure. Ah, one more thing. When you are out at sea with few landmarks to go by, you will be at the mercy of your sea chart. I have marked the place we should currently be heading for you for on your sea chart. If you get lost at sea, simply press forward to open the chart and confirm your position. Now, I westerly, a westerly wind blows. Hop on and let it carry us to the east. Um, here we go. Boop. Da, 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 da. Take this out here, something, something or other. Huh? What? Do I need to get in first and then take it out? I'm so confused. How does this work? Okay, there we go. Uh, I just bought a steam cleaner to be more eco-friendly and still making sure it kills bacteria. <gasps> Wait, what's a steam cleaner? Okay, I see. How do I go faster? Um, am I supposed to go... Where am I going? Over here? Oh my gosh. Once. Okay, so am I facing the wrong way? Um, okay. Ah! <laughs> we go this way? Okay, here we go. I think we're getting it now. Yeah. Just found that I can wear Majora's Mask in this Minecraft mod pack. I mean, oh, that's cool. I w I'm curious to know what a Minecraft Majora's Mask looks like. Because it's very. Minecraft's very blocky, isn't it? And Majora's Mask is very triangular <laughs> dun, 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 dun. oh what is this I just went through oh can we go over these oh oh no I missed mm. there's so much Is that the, um, fortress? 
Oh my gosh, I'm missing all these rupees. A wild onyx appears! <gasps> yes! Man, we got so many seagulls. Wait a minute. We lost Tetra and the other pirates. I just realized that. I'm assuming this is the forgotten fortress, forsaken fortress. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 I'm just like saying random songs. There, on the horizon. That is our destination, pool lady. Dragon Roost Island. Oh, is that really where we're supposed to be going? I thought we were supposed to be going to back to the fortress. Or is that the end game? High atop this island's peak lives the spirit of the skies, a great dragon by the name of Balu. You must go see this dragon and request, request from him a jewel called Din's Pearl. Ask the people of the Rito tribe who inhabit this island about who, how to see who inhabit this island about how to see the dragon. Dun, dun. No! Oh, I almost forgot. Wait just a moment. This is the Wind Waker. It is a baton of sorts that is used long ago when the people played music in prayer to the gods. In those days, simply using it allowed one to borrow the power of the gods, but I do not know if it still works. Even so, I thought it might be of some use to you. Perhaps you should be using it. <gasps> the Wind Waker! First conduct in four th third three fourths time. Blech. Do not touch that. Try to match the rhythm by tilt. Oh gosh. I don't know. Okay. Um. Oh my gosh. What am I doing? What? Um. I am so confused. <laughs> what is the matter, pool lady? You do not have to time it exactly, just be sure to be holding that in the proper direction when the metronome hits the center. Also, you do not need to touch thing to keep just till- okay. I'm not using a GameCube controller, so I have no idea what ones I'm supposed to be using. That- wait, am I doing it again? Oh, wrong direction, that's why. Very nice, that was splendid. Next is four for time. Okay. Oops, wrong way. Um, ah! Oh, my controllers are backwards. Okay, hold on. Bum, 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 bum. Wait a minute! I'm messing it all up! How come... Oh, okay. I see. I'm... I'm lost. I got it. I got it. I understand now, sort of. Okay. So I need to hold this. And that, okay. 
That's it, pool lady. That was not bad for your first time using the Wind Waker. Not at all. You can also conduct with it in 6-4 time by tilting. You would do well to remember that. That's insane. You receive the legendary Wind Waker by using this magical conductor's baton. You can borrow the power of the gods. Set it to that blah 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 blah. Okay. I am gonna take a tiny little break though, even though it's only been an hour. But I'm gonna put up boards on stream. Uh, use the bathroom and get some water. Boop. Words on stream for some funs. Fun times. I'll be right back.
I'm back. Sorry. My bad. Okay. Thank you for being patient. That was probably like a good 10 minutes, sorry. <laughs> or longer. Um, okay. So now we are here. Give bagel. I finished bagel. <laughs> I don't have any more bagel. Danger. Do not attack the explosive fruit. Can I lift it? Oh! How is- how is your morning going so far? Oh my god, no. Well, that kind of sort of worked. I think that's Beetle over there. Yay, hearts. What does this say? Um... Okay. It says up. Uh, am I supposed to like throw? Oops. <laughs> I just blow myself up. Interesting. I, I feel like I'm supposed to... Um, oh my gosh. How do I- how- how do... Uh, blow those things up. So that it blows that up. But like, how do I reach that up? Yeah. I woke up sore. I need to stretch. Had some pe- You need to stretch so you have not stretched yet? Why have you not stretched yet? Uh, have pizza for breakfast. That's the breakfast of champions. Chill it now. Then more stretching and maybe Fortnite. Lazy. You, what? But, but it's for your health, right? Oh my goodness. Um... I feel like that bagel might have been a bad idea. Either that or I've like totally ruined my diet. Somehow you just motivated me. Final stretch in five minutes. In five minutes? Why not right now? You wanna stretch together? What is your, what do you have to do for stretching? I don't know why I picked the bomb up. Somehow you just motivated me. Why do you feel drowsy? No, my stomach. <laughs> my stomach's like, all of a sudden like, nope. Um, it's not drowsy. It's more like, bleh. Um, so I've been doing a lot better with my nutrition except last week about this time of the week I did again get a bagel sandwich and all the coffee and everything um there we go but um but yeah I don't know if my my stomach is like hey this is terrible food for you. Why are you eating it after eating better food throughout the week? And now my stomach's like, No, I reject this food. <laughs> Hate to break it to you, it's the coffee, and coffee does stuff to the stomach I can't say on stream. <laughs> but I don't know if it's the coffee. I mean, maybe, but like, I've been drinking coffee every day. Almost. Maybe it's the kind of coffee that I'm drinking. Because usually for breakfast, I'll either not have breakfast, the dairy, but I'll have milk every day. 
It's like my stomach's hurting. It's not that I just have to like go. It's like actually hurting. <laughs> like I'm cramping hurting. Uh, <laughs> welcome to the welcome to the island postal service. What do you have for delivery? Um, dun. I don't have anything for delivery. Pool lady! Pool lady, is that you? It is! I'm pleased to see you're okay. Tums? I, I might have Tums. I must say, you've traveled far from one with no wings. And your sister? Is she... Is that so? Well, don't worry too much. I'm sure she'll hang in there. I have an idea, pool lady. Would you like to meet our chieftain? I've told you, I, I've told my people here about you, and all of us Rito are very concerned. I'm concerned the chieftain will befriend you and lend you the aid of our Airy? Is that it? It's settled then. I'll fly on ahead and let everyone know you're coming. Come inside, pool lady. I'll be waiting. Oh my goodness. Oh, bum, bum, bum. So this away. I'm gonna throw this pot and throw this pot. Yo, rupee. Ugh. Well, have you discovered the cause of the great Valo's anger? No. Ah, so you're a pool lady, are you? Quill has told me all about you. A troubling tale, indeed. I insist that you let us know if there is anything we can do to help you. We shall do everything in our power to assist you. However, in the meantime, we have a problem of our own to deal with. When you arrive on when you arrived on the island, did you notice the raging dragon perched atop the mountain? As you can see, we of the Rito tribe are profoundly connected to the sky. We make our livings on the airways. We do so by the graces of the sky spirit, Velo. When a Rito reaches adulthood, he or she journeys to the top of Dragon Roost and receives a scale from the great dragon. It is this scale that enables the Rito to grow his or her wings. Recently, however, the once gentle Valo has grown violent and unpredictable. Sadly, we can no longer approach him. If this continues, the fledglings who are of age will never be able to receive scales from Valo on Dragon Roost. They will remain wingless and in time our very way of life will be threatened. As Chieftain of the Rito, my first responsibility is to solve this problem. My apologies, but I must ask you to wait for our assistance until this is done. Will you do so? Chieftain, what do you think of consulting Pool Lady in regards to your son, Prince Kamali? As you can see, Pool Lady is a gallant young lad. I feel certain that Prince Kamali would open his heart to him and speak freely of his fears and worries. That may be. Let me be direct. My son Kamali is of the age to earn his wings, yet he is weak in some ways, and in light of the current situation, he may just give up on ever getting them. What do you say? Will you share some of your courage with my son? Will you meet with my son? I thank you. We shall do our best to solve our problem as quickly as possible so that we may better help you with ours. I have something I wish for you to to give to my son. A young girl named Medilli is holding it for me. Would you find her and take it? I am counting on you. Here, pool lady, take this with you. Who knows, it might come in handy. Yay! Delivery bag! Finally, crafted bags like this are used by Rito Postman everywhere. 
Uh, I spy with my little eye. Give me hello, designer skyline. How are you? <laughs> um, you should find Medelli in one of the upper rooms. Leave the great ballow to us. In the meanwhile, do your best to aid Prince Kamali. Dun dun dun. Um. Oh my gosh. Oh, hold on, sorry. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> um, okay. So... Are these post boxes? Every time I see red, I think it's like, um, explosives or something. This way? Wow, do you really, you really do have green clothes and a strange shaped hat. You're a pool lady, aren't you? Oh, me. I'm an attendant to the Great Sky Spirit Vallow. My name is Med Medley. Well, to tell the truth, I'm not an attendant quite yet. I'm actually still studying to be one. Oh, what am I thinking here? This is from the chieftain. Pool lady wants you to give this directly to Prince Kamali. What is it? You accepted the father's letter. It is a letter from the father addressed to his son. Since you've just received a fine delivery bag, why not use it to carry this letter down to Kamali? When you want to take it out, choose your delivery bag and the item screen and blah, blah, blah. The room... <laughs> the room way in the back on the first floor is Prince Kamali's room. You have to go down a couple steps to get there. When you meet Prince Kamali, please don't get offended by his manner. He has no bad intentions, I promise. By the way, um, listen, pool lady. I have a small favor I'd like to ask of you. Could you please come to the entrance of Dragon Roost Cavern later? I'll explain everything then. Uh, okay. Your hair is so long. It's longer than you are tall. That's crazy. Okay, so we're going back down to the first floor. In one of these rooms. Maybe this one. Oh wait, that looks like the exit. This one, maybe? Kamali! Do you have a dragon ball? What is that? It looks like a dragon ball. <laughs> huh? Who are you supposed to be? What do you want from me, huh? I, I don't want to talk to anyone right now. Um, I think we need our delivery pouch. A letter? From my father? Oh, sure. Telling me to be brave is easy enough for him. It's not like he's the one who went through that horrible experience. It's not like he still has to go get a scale from Valo. You're in this letter too, you know. Poking your nose in other people's business. You're nosy, aren't you? Sorry, but I really don't feel like going to see Valo right now. I mean, how am I supposed to get a scale from him when he's so upset? What, are you trying to say that you can calm Valo down? Shh, that's just a big fat lie. It's easy to say you, uh, you can do anything. Bragging doesn't cost a thing. I'll tell you what, if you can find me someone who can get past all the obstacles on Dragon Roost to get to Valo, then I'll listen to anything you say. Um, okay, so we need to, like, do the obstacles. 
to get there. So go outside. Wait, where does that lead? The other door. This way. This way? Oh, there that one dude looked at me. Like, you're not supposed to go that way. Oh my goodness, what is happening here? Um, what if I jump down here? Oh, here we go. Hey, you actually came. I'm really sorry for bringing you to such a dangerous place. I had to. I wouldn't have asked if I didn't need help desperately. You see this place? There used to be a spring here surrounded by a beautiful pond. It was peaceful and lovely. But then the great Falu... He came, he became so angry, and in his rage, he shook the mountain, and this boulder crashed down, plunging the spring. You can see the result. Oh, but where is my mind? Tell me, how was Prince Kamali? Oh, that doesn't sound right, not at all. I may be partially to blame for that bad turn that Prince Kamali's taken. See, Prince Kamali's grandmother was the great Balu's former attendant. She was an amazing woman. I was honored to have her as my teacher. She was kind and brave and unsurpassed in her dealings with the great Balu. I am not yet worthy of being mentioned in the same breath as her. If only I possessed some of her strength, I am sure Prince Kamali would have felt more secure. Pool Lady, I am sorry to ask this, but I need your help. I want to go to the small shrine that's near the peak of the dragon roost, but that ledge over there is so high. If I could get some wind under my wings, I'm sure I could get up there. So, will you help me? Sure. Phew, thank you so much. Okay, pick me up. Then face that legend, toss me. Oh my thought, that was an actual narrator. Great job. <laughs> oh, thank you. The atmospheric currents are really messed up, so pay close attention to the direction of the wind. All right, I'm ready. Don't hold back now. Throw me as hard as you can. Lift. Wah. Oh my gosh, I legit have to like. I'm I'm fine. That didn't really hurt. What was I saying? Uh, oh yeah, once, uh, once more, with the wind. Toss away, please. Okay, with the wind. Wait. Which way am I going? This way. Oh. S oh my, what beautiful s stars. Twinkle, twinkle. Oh, where were we? Oh yeah, once, once more. With the wind, toss away, please. Okay, apparently I suck at this. <laughs> Do I need to like, get a running start or something? Why is she not getting up there? <laughs> uh, oh, pool lady, since when did you become triplets? No, uh, I'm fine. I mean, file? Fine? Come on, don't hold back. Use the wimp or wind and really toss me. Oh my goodness. I'm trying to use the wind. Okay, so this is going against. That's going right. That's going left. There we go. Now you got it. Yay, we did it. Oh, thank you. I think now I'll be able to climb Dragon Roost and meet with the Great Falu. Don't worry, I'll be fine. I may just be an apprentice attendant, but I can understand some of the great fellow's language. I'm not exactly bursting with confidence, but... Look, if anything happens to me, please look after Prince Val... Uh, Kamali. This is all I have to give you. I know it's not much, but please take it. 
Oh, we got an empty bottle. Cool. Bottles are great for carrying water and holding other things. Oh, and please don't tell anyone that I'm climbing Dragon Roost. It'll be our secret, okay? Well, good luck to both of us. Oh, no. I need to bring her with me. Or I need to go with her. Blah. I, I have received water. <laughs> Pour it on something that looks dry and withered. Uh, here. I have no idea. I'm just pouring water in places. Let's grab water. I don't know why we have it, but we're taking it anyway. These look like spots you could like blow up with some bombs or something. Can I climb up this? I can! Haha! Huzzah! Okay. Interesting. Aha! My brain is working! Except not very well. Where am I supposed to throw this at? Down here? <gasps> Oh. Okay, maybe we're just supposed to like blow this thing up. Hmm. I think this is correct, but I think I'm doing it incorrectly. There we go. Huzzah! We got it. Now we can go follow her! Right? Is that what we're supposed to do? I'm assuming so. Because Kamali was all like, I don't want to go unless you do all the things and basically make it easy for me. Mm. Okay. Um Is this like Twilight Princess where I have to like throw yeah, okay. Same con oops. Same concept. I have to throw a bomb into whoops. Uh oh. Oh my goodness. Ah! It brought me all the way back? Oh my gosh. Let's see. Oh, so we're going this way. And then... Oh! There we go. Huzzah! Goodbye! And we go this way now. Dragon Roost Cavern. Why? Why do the two on the left look like they're new, and then the one on the right's like ancient? So this is interesting. The Rito are bird people, but the music and the temple that we're going into is very like um goron-esque and fire temple vibes okay Oh no, there's little bad guys in here. Ooh, uh, uh, uh. 
I do feel like the enemies in this game are much easier. Unless it's just because this is like the first area. You know? Does the butterfly give you anything or are they just there? Oh, these pots, those pots had water in them. Okay, so there is, oh shoot. I was supposed to use this, I think, okay. There we go, we got fire. We come up here, we swing the fire. And we swing the fire again. There we go. <gasps> a chest! It just appeals. And I'm guessing key? Yeah, we got a small key. Use it to open locked doors. You can only use it in this dungeon. Okay, so we go this way. Streams that go to low! <laughs> When Waker was a Zelda you missed out on? Same. This is my first time playing it. Kimmy, have you ever seen lily pads in real life? I th I think so. I'm quite certain I have. Not for a while though. How are you streams and goes? Welcome in by the way. Um, we're still really early on in the game. This is kind of- this is, I guess, like, the third area if you want to count the starter area. But this is the first, like, real dungeon, I guess, or temple. Okay, so... It's looking like we have to go this way. Hmm... Oh, can I jump up here and then like, yeah, okay. This way? Ah, bats! Let me just get rid of this other- Ah! No, I didn't mean to do that. Oops. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, well, it starts you back over at the beginning. Okay. Mm, I was lurking on yours yesterday. I can't remember who raided on you. Seemed like a fun place to be though. Oh, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I had a, I feel like I had a lot of raids, so I don't think I could say who. We had a, I think, um, it wasn't Vegan Nunu that raided. It was Ratatash, I think, and then Twinkly Tor. And I feel like there was someone else, but I'm drawing a blank. Um, whoop! There we go. Well, I'm glad that you thought it was a fun place to be and wanted to come back. I usually, um, so I usually play, uh, or I've been playing Zelda, um, in lore order, like timeline lore order, um, and we already did the child timeline, was it the child time? Yeah, with, um, with Twilight Princess and Majora's Mask, um, how do I get over here? Or was I supposed to use... Hold on. Uh, glad to be here though. Yay! Glad glad that you are glad to be here. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, we... So we've been doing... We're on... What is this? The adult timeline? No. Is it the adult timeline? Oh my gosh. I've, I'm lost now. What is this timeline? Hold on. 
I have to bring it up because my mind is drawing a blank. So we already did the Child Arrow, Majora's Mask, Twilight Princess. We did Ocarina of Time, Four Swords, Minish Cap, Four, uh, Scarlet Sword. Yeah, so we're on Adult Era now. And then after Adult, we'll do the Fallen Hero, which is Link to the Past, Oracle of Season and Ages, Link's Awakening, all that good stuff. Um... <clears throat> But I don't just play Zelda. Um, I've been playing Elden Ring a little bit. Um, and sometimes do cooking streams or art streams and stuff like that. And, um, and then uh, we've just been doing some other random games here and there too. Because I'm just so like ADD with games that like, oh my gosh, how do I get through this? Am I putting it too close to the edge or something? Maybe. Um. It's like it. Interesting. Um. But yeah, a lot of, a lot of fun, a lot of random stuff sometimes. There we go. Okay, that works out better. Um, Kimmy, are you naturally very confident in front of the camera? Do you ever get shy? Um, I mean, sometimes, yeah. I feel like I'm more shy in person than I am. I mean, I know that there's people watching right now, but like, because I can't see you guys, I'm not as shy. <laughs> but if it was like, you know, if I was talking or like playing this game in front of however many people are watching like in real time, I would probably be, like my voice would probably be very shaky and all like shy and stuff. <laughs> Again, I think it's just because I can't see you guys. Uh -huh. That would be an interesting concept. What, to like play a video game in front of, like actually in front of people? I feel like, um, wait, how am I supposed to get past this? Hmm. Maybe with this? Red chew jelly, keep it in your spoils bag. This gelatinous goo comes from the deep within red choo choos. It's effective as a cure for exhaustion, but it can't be used in its current state. Okay. Um, where they don't talk to you, just type you messages, but you're sitting there on a I mean, yeah, that would be interesting. That would be interesting for sure. Do I use this? So this is a cool concept. This is the first time, I mean, I, we've already been picking up the other enemies' weapons, but I feel like Wind Waker here might be the first time that you are um, endure, like, picking up other enemies' weapons, like, regularly. You know? In the lore order, that is, anyways. RJ Boss, hello, welcome in, welcome in. How the flip you big stepping with a size seven man's on, huh? What does that mean? Um, you got a small key. I don't understand. Do you care to explain? Okay, this way. Uh, shoe size? Are you asking for my shoe size? <laughs> How the flip you big step in with a size 7 man's on? That's what it meant? Yeah, but like, I'm confused. Is that supposed to be like, uh, 
In reference to what, though? <laughs> Uh, one of those. Wait, wait. I have heard that Wind Waker does a good job of utilizing items beyond one time in the dungeon you found them on. Um, are you talking about the item, like the dungeon items? I feel like, I think Skyward Sword and Twilight Princess did the same thing, but, um, ooh, can I like? Oh, shoot. <laughs> I missed. Yeah. Ah! Oops. Um, but they only ended up using them, like, at the very end. On, like, the last dungeon or something. I need to, like... Can I not, like, activate these by throwing stuff at them? Yeah, yeah there we go. Okay. I guess I don't understand the, like, how the flip you big step in with a size 7 man's on. I know I get the size 7's a man's shoe size, but I don't understand what the big stepping is about. Like, is that supposed to be, like, I'm doing well with this game, or, <laughs> or what? <laughs> I don't know. I don't- I- I feel like I'm totally oblivious to not very blunt things. <laughs> mm -mm. I'm a very direct person. <laughs> mm, these people that go around asking streamers for suit shoe size to see their feet? Oh. Is that really what it is? Interesting. Well, I'll show you my shoe. Mm. My shoe actually is a size seven men's. <laughs> so I was like a little confused. I was like, how do you know what size shoe I have? Uh, thank you. I was wondering if I knew the person because of what they were saying. I was like, huh? What? How you know stuff? So, by me collecting all of these little choo choo jelly things, do I just. Am I be having like unlimited health now? Can I like. Oh. Wah! Nope, okay. This is broken. Oh yeah, cool. Mm. I guess I don't get often asked stuff like that, so it didn't really make sense to me. Uh, okay, so I can't go this way, it looks like. Wait, did I go this way? Oh, uh, it looks like I might need something that I don't have for that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay, so I went that way, and it brought me here. But now where do I go? What? Do I go up here? And then- was there another door that I missed, maybe? Oh shoot. That was the first time lava went that- Ah! Ugh. Dang, he jumped so high up. Mm, okay. We'll go back this way. We'll go the easy way back. Mm. 
We got... Okay, we have a... Oh, we do have a key. What am I doing? I don't know. Okay. So where was the other key? Not, not this way, was it? Yeah, we went this way. Wait a minute, but this doesn't have a key, it's just like locked. Ah, I'm so confused! Okay, um... I don't have any like bombs. Ooh, but if I take this... The map is the last- the map in the last area looks a bit like a bomb flower. Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, there we go. I said- <coughs> the map in the last area looks like a bomb Oh, like the shape of it. Oh, okay, we're outside now. Yeah, indeed. <laughs> uh, what the heck is that noise? Oh my gosh, I can cut the bridge? That's scary. You hear that? I need to get rid of that. Um... What do you call it? Um, is this the thing that's making the noise? I guess so. Um, gosh, what am I trying to say right now? Dog go- oh yeah, did you see the dog? Hold on. There he is. Uh, this is Bentley. Oh yeah, you heard your name, did you? Bentley! A little baby. Oops. Wrong one. There we go. Seems like such a sweet- he is. He's like the best dog I've ever had. I love all the other dogs I've had in my lifetime, but... He's definitely just the sweetest and the best. <laughs> ah! Oh no! Oh no, 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 no. Well, um, like, he's the first dog. It took a while. It did take a while, but I didn't, I don't think I actually really trained him. Unless I did it and didn't realize it, but like I can leave the back door open like while I'm getting like bringing stuff in and out of the house or whatever. Oh shoot. And um, and he'll just, I mean of course I still have to kind of like watch him and like tell him like no sometimes. But like he will just, um, he'll just stand there like he won't run outside. Well, other dogs I've had just be like, as soon as the door's open, psh, gone. He used to be like that when he was a puppy, but I think like now he's like, Oh, I actually want to be here and I do like you, <laughs> human. Let me stay <laughs> and uh, listen to your, your words. So yeah, he's, he's a great, great one. Yeah. Thank you for the stretch. <sighs> Did you do your stretch boosted? Oh my god, that felt so good. I don't think you could hear it, but my back cracked. <laughs> 
Oh my gosh. Okay. Ah! Oh my goodness. Oh. Hello, she. I thought you would forget. I did not stretch back well now. I usually do forget. <laughs> But I didn't this time. Oh, I'm supposed to just crawl over. Ever try the Spider-Man game for PlayStation 4? The ones I played were for the Nintendo 64 Game Boy Advance. I have not. Um, I have never played a Spider-Man game. I also don't have a PlayStation 4. Or a PlayStation 3. Or a Nintendo 64. Huh? Kimmy, I stretched out. But now I pulled a hammy. No! No, 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 no. That's not good. Are you, you need to drink water. Drink your water. That'll help. I, I promise. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I have my water I need to drink. Isn't it crazy that, like, I feel like I drink more water and I drink it faster when I use a straw versus just, like, drinking it. Mm, I'm not sure why that is. I've only played two Spider-Man games, one on PlayStation 1 and the other was PC, but technically it was not a Spider-Man game, it was Marvel, oh, but, um, but Spider-Man was in it. Can I like, oh, oh, Kimmy drinks like a fish. I try. Need to get, get your water in. I have not done super great with water intake um, over this past week and it's partially just because I've been on like PTO chilling and like I apparently just been bad about taking care of myself <laughs> but I'm trying to get back into the routine especially since I start work back in the next couple of days so work has helped work helps me stay on a routine apparently <laughs> Uh, oh, it hasn't been a good year. No, oh, Chris. No. I'm sorry your year hasn't been good, but I'm glad that you're getting some new people around. That's kind of I. That's kind of same for me a little bit too. I noticed I got better hydration if I drink fruit juice rather than two liters of water. Um. I drink like a smoothie in the morning. I think it's like the fruit juice, the smoothies like have the electrolytes and stuff that you need and then the water helps um, like it'll help retain the water and stuff you know in your body you stay hydrated. Pool lady have you seen any filthy thieving rats around? I know they're annoying but keep your wits about you. They are only rats. If you sp spread bait near their nest, they may share their store of treasure with you. Why don't you try it? I don't have any bait. What kind of bait? Um, put ice in your bottle of water. You put cold water, they're gonna bring work with you. I wanted to help you stay hydrated to the heat environment in Canada. Let us know the strength even though it's thirsty because it gets... Yeah. I I mean, you definitely need to stay hydrated in the heat for sure. Um, I know my dad... My dad's been like... Uh, has had heat exhaustion and stuff from not having water and being out in the heat. It was years ago, but... It happens. It does. Oh, I have a... Okay, I do have a key. Right? No, I don't have a key, sorry. I just saw the key symbol and I thought I had a key, but it says zero next to it, so I don't have a key. 
How am I supposed to get this one open? Interesting. I mean, I see this. No! You nasty little rats. And then uh, this. But I can't, like, climb with this. Okay, so I can climb that, but I can't climb that. There we go. What's down here? Oh no! <laughs> that has happened to me before too. Like, I call it sunsick when you get so sunburnt that you just, like, your body just, like, shuts down and you have to just sleep through it. That has happened to me a couple of times this summer, like, week, one week after the other, actually. But now I've got, like, a little bit of a tan, so I don't get, I don't get sunsick quite like I was. Call it heat exhaustion, that too. Definitely heat exhaustion. These birds sound so strange. Thanks for the key! Oh, don't fall off! Ooh, a feather. You got a golden feather! Keep it in your spoils bag. A certain strangeness emanates from the quill of this beautifully shining golden feather. Winged girls are said to be infatuated with these treasures. Oh, so we gonna get a winged girl, girl, a winged girl girlfriend. I can't talk. Oh. So when you start throwing it because the sun is sun poisoning, yeah, that's not good. Um, okay, I guess we'll light this thing up. We'll light this thing up. We're just gonna light everything up. All of these bats. Come on, bats. You got a joy pendant. You can keep it in your spoils bag. These pendants are said to flock to those who spread joy, like butterflies to nectar-filled blossoms. That's cool. Uh, no. I need my rupees. Yep. Oh, I guess I need to keep... I need this thing back. Uh, boop. Um, I like that there's all these crazy imagined monsters and then just bats, <laughs> right? <laughs> like these really unique strange things and it's like, oh, here's some bats. <laughs> I don't know why I picked this up. Oh, that's why. Ah! <laughs> blow myself up uh, okay can I like just drop it okay there we go got it Oof. I'm so bad at throwing the bombs <laughs> I don't understand like what the purpose of this little jar is oh big shame yes yes oh my gosh no! So don't go this. Don't go in those jars. What is. That's stupid. Don't go in the jars. Ah! This way. This way. Ooh, what is this? Huh? 
Oh, what the heck? That's cool. Hmm. I don't really need any more rupees, but I keep collecting them. Because I can only hold, hold two hundo. Okay, we gotta go up. Don't go in the jars anymore. Oh, it's way up here. Okay, we can. Oh my gosh, these birds. Why do you sound like that? Okay. There we go. I'm probably gonna have to wait again. Look at his face. He looks so sad or like mad all the time. <laughs> He's like, I can't even make that face. I can't make a sad face. No! I'm trying. I can't get my lips to go like down. Ooh! Okay. And then we just, we don't hop all the way up. We just go up and then go boop, boop, boop. Um, let's, no! Oh my gosh. Boop. Oh my, and I have to battle the bird again. Why is it that I have the bird still there but the boat goblin thingy is not? Let me wait. Okay, go. That's what you sound like, bird. Take that. Wait. He's like waiting on his tippy toes, too. Okay, go, 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 go. Uh, wait. Can I go in? Oh, I didn't even need to go to that door. <laughs> or go, like, that way that I did where I fell off. I just needed to go here. Silly me! I don't even need to, like, undo that other one. I just needed to get here. Okay, and then go up this way, and through here, okay, and through here, and through here. There, okay. Don't go in the pot. <laughs> um, okay. We're back. Heart. Rupee I don't need. Uh oh. Boat goblin. Oh my gosh. Ow, jeez. Can I get my health back? Easy peasy. 
Lemon squeezy. Um, is there a... There isn't a weapon that I can use to put on fire to light that other torch thing. Mm. Oh, there is, there is, there is, there is. Oops, I didn't mean to jump off there. Yes, we have found it. I wonder if I can sound like Morgan Freeman. <laughs> Probably not. But <laughs> if I could figure out how to sound similar, then maybe uh, I could just do a bunch of random narration. <laughs> You got a treasure chart. Uh, once you're out at to see, you open the sea chart. Okay, cool. <laughs> I'd love to see that. Yeah, if I could. I doubt it, but who knows? You never know until you try, right? Um, okay, well, so that gave me a treasure map or whatever, but how do I open this door? Do I need to, like... I don't know. I uh, can't do any accents of people or regions of the world. I want to say I can, but like, if you say, hey, do this kind of accent or whatever. Um, oh, there's another dude. Then I'll like try it, but it'll probably sound like some completely other country or something. <laughs> Like, I'll just have to do an accent, and then it'll be like, okay, you guys tell me what, where is that accent from. <laughs> uh, okay, can I, like... Like, do this or something? <laughs> I don't know. I know what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, right? Like, I can't give a specific accent. Okay. I don't know if this is even what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> I just feel like I'm sup- oh, huh? What is that thing? I just have a feeling I'm supposed to- Oh my gosh, what the heck? My That is not where my controller was telling you to go. Um. There we go. Uh, I feel like I'm supposed to just destroy all these pots, but like, how do I get that top one? Okay. Yeah, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. So I guess the top, top pot doesn't really matter. Whoa, there we go. Dun, 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 dun. I didn't. So this is the first time I feel like I've seen enemies like hiding in a pot. Whew, excuse me. Sorry. Don't mean to yawn. Oh no! They survive. In the uh, in the lava. They're they're like mimics. What do you mean? The uh, oh, goblin things. I think I need this thing to come over here. Oh no. The enemies that live in jars? Oh, that's what they're- is that what they're called? Or like, is that relating to something else? 
Oh shit, I'm sick. Oops. Mm. Okay. defeat this thing. I mean, like that, I, I'm guessing I'm hurting it, but like, how many times do I have to do that? Oh my gosh. Um, Mimic is a D&D &D monster. They are chests that are actually living monsters. Oh. I played D&D &D so long ago. Like, tabletop where you actually like meet up in person and roll the dice and all that stuff. Make your character sheets. I played like, what was it, 3.5, I think, and then Pathfinder. And then did a little bit of like, some Star Wars ones or something. Does this thing ever die? Or am I not fighting it correctly? Oh my gosh, stop falling off the ledge. Am I supposed to throw, throw a water jug at it? What am I doing wrong? Because there's no way that this lasts this long. Right? I feel like something's not right here. Yes, that, used, that was how I used to play many moons ago. Well now, okay, so it's going up. Okay. So we just had to hit it enough times that it's like, I don't like you anymore, I'm gonna move. I guess. Whee! Okay, there we go. Um, you, I played third first, then went to 3.5, then one and two, then four and five. For sure played most of third though, dang. I like how you kind of like jumped all over the place. Take this. Boop. I don't want to use the, the pot. Pot is bad. Pot brings you back to the beginning. <laughs> I don't like it. Um, and I don't have any water chests to go that way. Kimmy, I was worried when you, when you dyed your hair blonde. What do you mean? You were worried when I dyed my hair blonde? Cause it's blonder than, it's cause it's blonder even than mine? Well wait, why would that make you worry though? I thought it would mean we clash now? Oh my gosh. It looks, it usually looks this, oh shoot. It usually looks this blonde uh, right after I do it cause I tone it. But then as the toner kind of fades away, it it's, doesn't look quite the same. 
I'm so confused. Oh my goodness, okay. Um, yeah, my friend had books for third, and his neighbor lent him one and two, so we tried that. That's cool. Um, one of my old, like, high school boyfriends sent me a message on Facebook not that long ago. Um, and he actually, he sent it because he was telling me, and I guess everybody else that we all used to play in D together, um, that he created his own book. His own D&D book, rule book or whatever. Um, I don't play anymore, so I don't, I didn't get it, but. Thought it was kind of cool. I'm not really sure like what kind, if it's like a classic D&D type thing or if it's like some other... Ooh, what is this? You got a skull necklace, you can keep it in your spoils bag. If that's rather off-putting accessory would appear to be a little value, to be of little value, but shown to the right person is apparently of great worth. Ooh, ooh. What? Oh my gosh. I have a strong feeling that, like, Valu just has, like, a thorn in its paw or something. Pool lady, you came to rescue me. Oh, thank you. I have to tell you what I found out. This is terrible. Some creature is doing awful things to the great Valu's tail. That's why he's so angry. The great Valu's tail hangs down into the room right below here. There's got to be something in there. I wonder if those mean monsters who captured me have something to do with it. We've got to do something now before it's too late. I'll go and tell everyone what's happening. Here, pool lady, use this to get out of here. It's what I used to get this far. It's a device we Rito use before we evolved wings. Yay, can I fly? Oh, grappling hook, you heck yeah. What, this is the first item you get in the game? <laughs> you feel like all the other Zelda games, you wait till like the end. This is the item used to the Rito people before they had wings. Sweet. Okay. Uh, you can even use it to haul things from the sea floor while you're in the boat. That's cool. Um. Here, pool lady. Climb up on that little ledge over there so I can show you something. I'm bringing this with me. If I can. Grab this branch with the grappling hook and you can swing over there to get out of this area. When you aim at a branch that you can latch onto, Link will appear. Remember that. Don't worry about me, pool lady. Get going! Okie dokie! Uh, there we go. Ooh, uh... Ooh. Boosted! If you're still there, have you done your stretches? I'm checking in on you. Yep. Okay. So... Boop. Boop, boop. How much farther down is this tail of Valu? What? Right in here? Mubby? Oh, 
Okay, sorry, I had to check on something. Oh my gosh, I don't want the bridge. No! I feel like I make like little itty bitty minor uh, mess ups. Okay, there we go. Wait, how the heck did you survive? Like, ah. Okay, there's that. Oh, there you are. Um, oh, okay, here we go. How do I get down there? Do I just have to, like, entrust that, like, oh gosh, I don't like this. I guess we're just breaking the bridge. Oh. Yep. There we go. We got another joy pendant! Cool. Um, this way? There's water jugs? Um, okay. So, this way? Oh no. Am I supposed to... I guess so. Okay. Oh, this way? Yeah. And here? Yeah. Yeah. This, this reminds me, there's like a little video meme or something, or like a reel that this girl did. <laughs> She's like, oh, when life is so hard, and like, I can't remember what she says, but she, it's all like sad and stuff, right? And then she, and she was just like, man, life is just so hard. But then I remember the wise words of, of you know, someone or Link or whatever. And then she's just like doing this. And all you hear is like, or all you see is like um, an inspirational kind of poster. But it has Link. And then it's just like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's just like, <laughs> uh, I think it's so funny. Okay. It's so stupid. <laughs> oh, I was like, where am I going? But now I see. Um. Uh huh. No, bats! I'm running from you. Mm. Okay. Meep. Uh, okay. So I'm guessing that I need to go this way instead. Ooh! No, I don't need to do that. Okay, I see, I see. Whoa! Whoa! Who? I just barely made that. This way. This is a long way just to get to a tail. 
Oh. Okay. Ah, this thing again. Ooh, can I use you? <laughs> Hopefully you stay in a little... Oh. I just want to drop you. Can I just drop you? Oh no. Hmm. Oh my gosh. I can just drop you. I just need to do it properly. Oh my gosh. Ugh. Stay. There we go. Stay there. Don't don't get up. <laughs> get the big key, the dungeon key. Let's go. Oh man. Where is the dungeon now? What are you? Oh man, well I lost out on that thing. Whoop! Whoop! Hop! Whoa! Fire bats! Are these also keys? Or are they just bats? Okay, so we need to like stop and then like turn ourselves around <gasps> to compose. Hello! No, they are keys as well. <laughs> oh man. How are you doing? Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. We. Whoop! How have things been? Okay. Oh my goodness. The Kisses. Um. So now. Do I use this? Wait, where is the, um. How do I look at the map again? Oh, this way. Oh, okay. Interesting. How do I get there? I don't even know if this is where I need to go. Maybe. Ah! Oh, what am I doing wrong? Okay, I was just pressing the wrong button. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. No, don't you attack me. Okay, wait. Uh, wait, no. I need to go down. And like, adjust the way I'm- Ah! Stop! I don't understand how the controls work! Okay, all the way down. Turn this way. Swing. 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 Oh my gosh, I can't believe I made that. Ugh. I hate the keys. Okay, I just want to get out of there. Can I even go up from here? Whoa, I like slid.
There's no way to go up, right? So I need... This was not the right way to go. Um... How... Where am I now? I need to get to the third floor. And I feel I have went the wrong direction. Hmm. And this is like the only way. Go up this way? Um. Kimmy, my sister-in-law said that my nephew likes to cry at night and replay and reply that he likes to sleep all day and party at night. Oh, isn't that a song? Can I, if I, I barely could jump to that. Can I jump to the bridge? Party, baby, yo. I don't know. I don't think I'm supposed to go that way. No. Uh, okay, um. Hey, Kish. They're so annoying. I'm gonna see if I can jump to this bridge, which might be like crazy talk. Yeah, I thought so. Uh, I don't know where I don't know where I need to go. I feel like I'm like at a dead end or something. You know, I'm sure I'm not, but it just feels like it. May the force be with you, thank you. Yeah, I'm this is probably like stupid. What am I doing? I need to walk through. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. Oh no. Well, I died. It's fine. Okay. Walk through the Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. So we're on... Uh, Dragon Roost Cavern? Sure, I'd like to save. Um, okay. So... Yeah, we got through that. We got the grapple hook. And we've got the dungeon key. Grub! Hello, how are you?
I'm so confused. Doing very existing? Already looking at the- yeah, cause I'm like, I'm lost on how to get to the boss room. <laughs> well now I'm like back at the beginning, so that'll help I guess. Like I just- I felt like I was in an area where like I literally was stuck. Or maybe it was just dumb. <laughs> I don't know. Will this like bring me somewhere? Where will this bring me? I mean I know I'm not dumb but like I just was so confused, like, there was, it was like, oh, you could go this way, but then I felt like I just came from that way, and then it was like, or you could go this way, and then I was like, I don't know, like, there was a grapple hook area, but I didn't know where I was supposed to swing to, to get there. I was just a tad lost. Okay, so we're on the second floor now. If I go this way. Have you be have you beaten Wind Waker before, Grub? No? Have you have you played it at all? I played a bunch of it, but you just never beaten it. Oh well, shoot. Oof, oof. There we go. You watched your buddy beat it? I think I quit on the- on the sixth dungeon. How many dungeons are there? Okay. Here is... the boss room. But like, I don't have, um, oh wait, grapple hook. We found the boss room. Usually there's eight, oh, eight dungeons in each game. I don't think I actually like ever kept track of that. The last boss fight death scene is rad for this game. Ooh, I'm excited then. Oh my gosh, can I just like open this chest? I don't want to be in fight mode. I just want whatever this is. Cool. Hookshot is eye out? Oh, is that what it is? I was wondering why those creatures never died. I don't really care. <laughs> I'm just gonna go get the boss. <laughs> Are you still on vacation? Oh, this is- yeah, this is the first dungeon. Nope, you're back. How was your trip? Okay, so there's the tail. Oh my gosh! Finding it really hard to get motivated to stream again! No! Trip was warm and I loved that. So, what is the weather like where you are at in Alaska? Okay, hold on. So... Am I supposed to whack this or no? Oh, or am I supposed- okay, so let me see. He attacks, right? And then I guess I get out of the way and then use this. No? Okay. Mingles, hello! How do I... Mm. I know I'm supposed to use the hook shot, but like, in what way? In what time? Because he closes his eye. 
before I before it gets to him. Oh, and this is probably the time to use the hook shot. No. Uh, Kimmy, I was Wind Waker. I, I am, but I'm a little confused at this moment. Like, what I, how I'm supposed to attack this guy. Ugh. Do I just, like... I don't understand. Yesterday was 7 degrees and sunshiny as hell. Today it's 50 and rainy. Oh, no. Hookshot eye? When he attacks you, use it? But like, even right now I'm like... Hook, every time I hookshot his eye, he closes it. Before the hookshot even comes to... Um, can you cut the arms when they're on the ground? When I do, it just like, it's like it's armor or something. Like it doesn't do anything. <clears throat> I'm wondering, I see platforms up here. I'm wondering if I'm supposed to like, I need health. Maybe I'm supposed to bomb. Or something. Maybe I use... Can I not, like, hookshot any of this up here? Ugh! What other tools do you have? Run up the arms? It's telling you to press A for some reason. I missed the best music in the game. I'm so sorry. No. Okay, wait. When is it? Oh, I've missed that. The A button keeps flashing. A mighty enemy stands before you, even the face of such danger. Even in the face of such danger, however, you would be wise to change your perspective and see what is around you. It is important to get a firm grasp of your surroundings and see what you can use to swing the battle in your favor. I mean, I see platforms that I could prob probably jump onto, but like... Oh, maybe this? The tail? Swing the battle in your favor. Okay. Ugh, man. Oh. Wait, whoa. I've used up all of the pots. Okay, there. Um, Kimmy, do you do electrical work too? What do you mean, electrical work? Full, full the tail down. <laughs> it's okay, just don't get hit again. Oh, there we go. We got pots now. Um. I'm just gonna keep doing this, I guess. Andy, hello! How comes it can be? It's going good now that I kind of sort of understand what I'm supposed to do for this battle. It took us probably like 10 minutes for me to figure it out. <laughs> Okay, so now it looks like we've gotten rid of the armor. Uh, 
Oh my gosh. Do I need to just keep doing this? Oh no! My platform! Oh no. He- he is angry. Oh no, it didn't go. No, I missed it again, I think. Oh my gosh. Timothy, thank you so much for the raid. How are you doing? You're playing Twilight Princess? You're doing a randomizer, weren't you? How's it going? How's your day going? Damn, I forgot how awesome this game was. <laughs> yeah, this is my first time playing it. I forgot to put that in the title, but... Oh my gosh. Do I need to... Oh my god, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. No! Crap. Bleh! Just, uh, you're good? Just sipping coffee before gym? Usual stuff? Nice. What kind of coffee are you drinking? Hyper underrated is Zelda title in my- What do you mean? Like, a Zelda- like the Wind Waker is hyper underrated? Or the title that I gave it? <laughs> Wind Waker Day 2. Um, <laughs> uh, okay. Yes. At least you know what to do this time. True. Oh, wait. Do I have to start over? Ah, oh, crap. Cafe Bustello, just black nice. I I like that coffee. Uh, so two people gave this game such crap. I I was one of those people when it first came out only because of the graphic, like the art style. I wasn't a cell shade fan. But it's been fun so far. Wind Waker, it kind of, it got kind of lost in the shuffle, especially since it came out on GameCube. True. Is this is this the only game? This isn't the only Zelda game that was a GameCube game, right? But there wasn't very many of them. You are not playing Rando. Forgot to change the, your intro. Oh, okay, okay. You're just playing it normal did you just start it or like how far are you in twilight princess oh twilight princess was gamecube i don't know why i always thought it was like wii i know it came out like hd on like wii or wii u or whatever i guess or something okay this way it was GameCube and Wii. Okay. Mm. No, you took my water base thingy. I dislike these little things so much. Stop! <laughs> I'm so mad at this little worm thing centipede thing. I don't know. I don't like you. You remind me too much of the boss I'm about to go battle. Go away. Nobody likes you. Ugh. There we go. Um, plus re-releases of older titles. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I was playing vanilla game. I got to the first temple boss, then stream started having issues, so I kept up from facing him. Oh, no. Sorry that you're having stream issues. That sucks. But the first boss, I can't remember what the first boss battle is. I feel like it's it was like some water thing or something or water-esque thing Ooh, oh that was a fairy but it wasn't like water temple 
I just I feel like I just remember water being around it. Um, like Ocarina of Time. Uh, like Ocarina of Time Master Quest Majora's Mask 1, 2, and a link passed on a special disc. Oh, Star Wars should be fun. <gasps> yes! Thank you for the reminder. So in my Discord, if you're not already in the Discord, um, we are doing a Star Wars movie marathon. And I'm saying it like this because we're not going to watch all the Star Wars in one day. We're doing it like every Saturday. Um, so every Saturday at 9, I think it's 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Let me double check. Yeah, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, starting tomorrow, we're doing all the Zeldas in, um, we're doing it in story order, so that means Phantom Menace is first, and then Attack of the Clones, and we're only doing the movies, we're not doing the shows, I think there's an animated movie, but I feel like people voting that one out, so if you don't want to miss watching all the Star Wars and you're not already in the Discord, join the Discord! Um, damn, that's rough, dude. You'll get them next time? Yeah! Uh, could have continued but wanted to stream the whole game, so I stopped. Yeah, I get that. Like, just you wanting to stream the whole game and then not have, like, uh, interruptions. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. There. Okay. First boss is the- yeah, the tentacle thing or whatever. Uh. Oh, it's in the actual order, nice. Yeah. Never. I never saw the animated one either. I had to pull up- I pulled up a- a list of all the movies. Just to make sure that I was getting them all in the right order and I wasn't gonna miss movies. Cause I'm- it's not just like episode 1, episode 2 that we're doing. I'm also gonna add in like Rogue One, Han Solo, like where those are supposed to be in the-, the oh my gosh. So it's all of the movies minus the animated one I guess. Since nobody wanted to see that one. <laughs> um... Oh my gosh, I'm rushing. There's a Christmas special one? There we go. And no matter what I tried, the screen remained froze? No! Even doing like a uh, display capture or whatever? It's infamously bad. <laughs> I don't know if I've seen it. I'm just gonna get this up and ready so I can just grab it right away. Or as right away as it the yeah, other. I've heard it's the worst Star Wars release ever. That's crazy. Watching the Christmas special. All I remember is Carrie Fisher being a <gasps> Are you serious? Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Okay. Um. So now what do I do at this part? Oh no. Phase two. Uh, I need hearts. Yeah, my OBS decided I had enough. No. Can I hit whack this? Oh no. <sighs> I think so, boosted. Wait, I've heard it's the worst Star Wars release. It made it. It was like made for TV talk show special movie, right? Oh. So like, if I, why does it turn me around? 
If I do this, does it do anything though? No, I just, I just get over here, okay. Okay, so that's what I'm supposed to do now. Did I get him? Or is, or is there a th third face? Looks like I got him. Yay! We got him! Whoop, 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 whoop! I was about to say, I get to keep his eyeball! That is not the case. I don't get to keep the eyeball. <laughs> Also, Dragon Roost Island's music is such a bop. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So now do we have... Uh, you got a heart container. Your life energy is increased by one. So we... Um, so I guess we just go towards the sparkly, glowy center. So, uh, is he still upset? Or is that him going like, yay, I'm not upset anymore? <laughs> cool lady! Well, Prince Kamali, don't you have something you want to say? Um, I heard everything from Medelli. Cool lady, thank you so much. I'm sorry I mistrusted you. I hope I can be like you someday, pool lady. You will, Kamali. I just know it, right, pool lady? So, pool lady, uh, here. I want you to take this, pool lady. Giving you the thing I ha value most will give me the courage I need to stand up to bad things. You received Ince Pearl! This is the gem the Rito's claim was passed down by the great goddess. <laughs> the great Valu is grateful to you, pool lady. I don't speak dragon. Use the wind god's wind? That's what he said, but I don't understand. I wonder what it means. The Wind God's Wind, I wonder if what he's talking about has anything to do with the Wind Shrine that's through the, that tunnel. Oh, I almost forgot. The Great Valu also names you Pooh Lady, a true hero. I agree with him. As far as we're concerned, Pooh Lady, you really are a hero. Well, I'm going to go and visit Valu. I'll come and see you sometime with the best pair of wings ever. Oh. Hey, Prince Kamali! Thanks so much, Pooh Lady. See you again someday. I feel like I'd like throw some random voice in when I have no idea who's talking. <laughs> uh, fun fact, this game has sort of a new game plus feature where you play the game wearing your pajamas and you can understand the sort of text value just what? What? That's pretty cool. Oops, BRB ads. No ads. Um, I want to see... Can I, like... Do something with this over here? Or is this more of, like, a thing I'll have to figure out another time? Maybe. I don't understand. Dun-dun-dun-dun-dun. 
There's rupees in here. And a heart. It would seem that Ganon set those monsters to this place. But that would mean there is no time to lose. We must depart at once for the place where the next pearl sleeps. We sail to the south. Hmm. Before we leave, Windshrine Mail Center. What do we got over here? Uh, oh. I don't have any bombs. Oh, here we go. Wind shrine? There appear to be markings that indicate specific directions. Welcome back! So... It's broken. Interesting. Spe specific directions. Oh, okay, up left or right. The Wind Waker. I forgot that you had to put the Wind Waker and sail on buttons in the original. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so in the HD you don't have to? Well, that's nice. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that's a mighty nice breeze. Oh, it was on the D pad? That's nice. The name's Zephos. I'm the god of winds. So, you're the new Wind Waker, are you? Great, great. For a beginner, you've got a nice wind sense about you. I like you, kid. The tune you just picked up, well, it gives you control over the direction the wind blows. Depending on how it's used, wind can be a good thing or a very bad thing. You want an example of it being a bad thing? Then you should see my brother. It saddens me to say that my brother Psycho? Cyclos? Is muffed about his monument here being broken and now he's spent his time creating cyclones to torment people. So, if you encounter any cyclones at sea, justice my brother for me, will you? And that is my request for you. <laughs> Dang, he's like flying away like on Nimbus. Okay. Well, we have beaten a dungeon slash island thingamabob. I think that is gonna be it for me today. Oh no, Bumble! <laughs> Hello! You're like, I'm back! And then I'm like, oh, I think I'm gonna be done now. <laughs> no! <laughs> Thanks for the stream, you're welcome! I know, it's kind of a short stream for a Thursday or Friday, but... Oh! I'm kind of like, when it comes to the Zelda games, I feel like it's best to stick to like doing one dungeon or if you can do two do two but i hate stopping like in the middle of a dungeon or temple or area um if i don't have to stop in the middle or whatever and i just yawn i feel a little tired but i also have like other stuff i want to get done and whatnot and what and stuff <laughs> so i gotta do that but I'm glad I was able to get a little bit more Wind Waker in today. That's how I quit Skyward Sword, Skyward Sword mid dungeon and never went back. No. And are you gonna start it over again when you do the Zelda, or are you gonna just start from there? Um. Yeah, I'm gonna start it over. Okay, okay. Oh man. Um. Dun, 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 dun. Ooh, oh my gosh. I hardly ever get to raid Min because she 
always streams before me. But I see she's on. So we're gonna go say we're gonna go say hi to Min. She's playing Pikmin 4 and I've never really played Pikmin, but um it looks cute and she's absolutely freaking obsessed with Pikmin. Or she was recently. I'm assuming she still is. <laughs> um, so we'll we'll go say hi to Min. She's super positive, wonderful girl, lady, woman. I don't know why I keep why I said girl. <laughs> <laughs> um, if you're not subscribed, you can use that rave message. If you are subscribed, you can use the second one. I thank everyone who came and hung out with me today um, and kept up with the uh, Wind Waker. Tomorrow, tomorrow is not a stream day, but we are watching um, the Star Wars movies in uh, story order or whatever chronological order would that be the right phrase um, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in the discord not on twitch in the discord I put the Twi discord link if you want to join the discord if you're not already in there and hope to see you then so no stream tomorrow just Star Wars and then it will stream on Sunday okay well say hi to me and with me um, I'll see you guys next time thank you for hanging out bye 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 bye